People spending more time at home is making one metro agency very popular. News Channel 5's Jason Lamb shows us that Metro Animal Care Control, as well as, well as other shelters across the area, their pet fostering programs are booming. Staying at home may have its benefits for Metro Animal Care and Control. Many of the pets at their shelter have been fostered out. The community has stepped up and to foster and help out Max so much. Last March, the agency signed up 12 people on its so-called foster roster. This March, in the throes of COVID-19, 447 people signed up. People are home. People have realized, I think, how what a great time it is to spend time with animals. They're lonely. Um, they have the time to learn about them. These are just some of the pets benefiting from that increase who are now with foster families. There's Jojo and Eugene, and we can't forget about Princess. Some pets have even become what animal control calls foster fails, but don't let the name fool you. This video of Jack was taken by his foster family, the same people who became Jack's permanent adoptive family. Yeah, a foster fail is actually a wonderful thing, so we want those as much as we can have them. Metro Animal Control says they hope this foster trend keeps up after COVID. Our hope, because our foster roster has grown so much, is that we can stay with that momentum and keep as many animals always in foster homes. For a better chance at finding their pets a forever home. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5. <laughs> Hope that story had you smiling. If you would like to join the Foster roster, we have the link at newschannel5.com.